In just a few days, China is going to put its second space lab into orbit. CCTV's Guan Yong reports from the launch center. Strong winds in the Gobi Desert are unwelcome for any launch mission, as rapid changes in direction would create enormous air pressure for high-speed rocket flight. The story of those who work in the desert reflects the spirit of China's space program, an unwavering determination to persist. After the rocket reaches the launch pad, it is our job to fill the boosters prior to the launch. We have to double-check all of the docking ports on the rocket to ensure there won't be any leakage during filling. Tiangong-2 was originally built as a backup to China's first space laboratory, the Tiangong-1, which went into orbit in 2011. The Tiangong-2 is similar in size to the Tiangong-1, but boasts a large payload capacity better living quarters, and new communication technologies on board. There is still a lot of preparation work that needs to be done before the launch. Transmitting information from Tiangong-2 to the test center is crucial during the pre-launch drills. Tiangong means heavenly palace in Chinese. The new space lab will host two astronauts for 30 days once it is stocked with Shenzhou 11 spacecraft next month. China's second space lab has drawn international attention. This is the first Chinese mission of its kind. Guanyang, CCTV, Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center.